Go see Q's new pet. You'll soil your britches. Where did he find that beast? the size of this beautiful creature. Impressive, isn't it? Clear eyes, strong haunches. It must come from powerful stock. You fools. It could swallow the moon next month if it continues to grow like this. I know your mind, Javi. But this wolf is not your enemy. The signs of Ragnarok, when it comes, will be clear for all to see. Tyr, you roll bones in a game you do not understand. That may be. But I'll assume the risk. If there's a price to be paid, I'll pay it. It's the Jotnar that trouble us now. Have you spoken with the Builder? The Builder, yes. Is Freya nearby? She's teaching Thor about organizing armies. A battle they're both losing. Come along then. You must all hear what I have to say. You spoke with the Builder. You saw his work. I did. And the sickness... These markings are your worry. Enough of this sorcery, woman. Just point me towards the enemy and I will handle them. Javi, you look troubled. The Builder gave me a demonstration of his magic. He conjured a shield that killed invaders on contact. That would do well for us. But your expression says otherwise. I fear the price is too high. What does he want? You. Me? Does he take us for slavers? I will smash his skull till he shits out brains! Now hold on, everyone. Let's weigh the... Do not finish that thought. What was your reply? I told him it was your choice alone. You didn't refuse him outright? For good reason. If the Builder believes he has a chance, he will continue his labors. A dog will not keep working for the mere promise of a bone. How about I beat on his liver till he builds us a wall for free? Might we consider... I will not barter with my body. That would be a first. Hold on. I've got it. The blunt end of my hammer on his family stones. You are overthinking this, all of you. Give this builder an impossible task, a deadline of, say, nine days. When he forfeits, as he no doubt will, Freya remains free, and we may finish his work as intended. He would be mad or stupid to agree. You underestimate men of intellect, Lord of Storms. The builder is a proud man. He won't back down from a challenge. I do not like this. Nor do I, but we must act. Loki, bring this offer to the Builder. Your will is my deed, Rune Writer. You grapple with forces outside your control. You were eager to see the deal done. We're Asir. She's Vana. Watch out! Keep your distance! The wolf! Shit! Tyr, stand back! I'll get it! Out of the way! The wolf is mine! Yeah! Stand! I'll sharpen my axe with your teeth, beast! The final blow is mine. Do not fight the beast! Leave it to me!
Are you the wolf foretold? Are you my doom? Are you destined to destroy me? I am the death wolf! I am the living ghost! I cannot die! We will see which is stronger, your fate or my will. your life. Will you do the same? I've warned you well, and look where it has led! Away, Loki. You swore an oath to never spill my blood. Step aside, and I won't have to. This is my blood. What? He is my son. Bastard! Dear, you've cared for this wolf. 
you will be his jailer. Take it to Lingby. Find it there. Make sure it never leaves the island. I can speak with the Dwarf Ivaldi. May he find a more permanent solution. Come, boy. You're safe with me. Be kind, Justice Pringle. Loki, there will be a reckoning. I have no doubt. This rump clown. I was only curious, dwarf. I meant no offense. I'm merely a seeker of knowledge. The dwarves give nothing away for free. Apologies for the distraction, Master Blacksmith. I'll leave you to your work. Well, what shall I craft for you today, High One? Bottomless breaches for soiling yourself on the battlefield? Do your people believe they will survive the final battle? Harvey, my gentle jailer, you know we dwarves give nothing away for free. If you want your question answered, I'll need something in return. Such as? A hidden fact known only to you, Farseer, that I may share in your secret knowledge of the world. The sun and the moon are pulled by two horses across the day and night skies. Skinfaxir and Chaimfaxir are their names. And each morning's dew is the fallen slopper from Chaimfaxir's foaming mouth. Curious. Thank you, Harvey. As for your answer, many dwarves will die in the final battle. Ground into earth and reclaimed by the mountains. You talk of blood and bone. 
but I speak of your Huga. Can your spirit survive when life leaves the body? Some say that Huga enters the items they craft. Others believe they live on in song. Personally, I don't give a rat's ass for philosophy. Now, if that's all you came to know, you can piss off and let me work. I have one more need. Can you forge me an unbreakable chain? Chains are overrated. One weak link and it's worthless. Let me craft the cord that Thor himself could not break. It must be strong enough to bind a powerful beast. I will sluice my sweat into this cord, Harvey. All knowledge I have and skill I own will define it. And what will I get in return? My thanks and my hospitality. What more could you need? Blah. You cannot barter with a man who's squeezing your balls. You may always return to the land of fire, Ivaldi, and die as your brothers did, roasted on a spit. Hmm. To craft such a cord, I'll need a few impossible ingredients. Name them. I the list there. I have a bear's tendon, a fish's breath, and... A cat's footsteps? And the root of a mountain? How do I find these? How the fuck would I know? The riddles will guide you. I have no patience for riddles, Dwarf. Those riddles are as ancient as the world. With lore passed down from Nii and Nidi to Northri and Sudri, Austri and Vestri, Althjover... I understand. I will return shortly. What do you see?
Yes, that's you. Who put you up here, little cat? What do you see, Sunan? That's how it is. Lead the way, nimble one. Your sound. I seek. There's no higher 
Mozambique. He has made the base already. The builder works fast, a bit too fast. Go, Zulin. This looks like the right place. I swear, dwarves would choose riddling over right there is the seed and the mountain's rocky grip. Some heat may free it from its shell. Cast about this land, my friend.
made me be my eyes. sprout root until I get it into some water. Retrieve the root for Ivaldi before it takes hold. Let's see what you can make of these, Ivaldi. How is he building that tower so quickly? There's more to this stranger than meets the eye. I know what counts for. 
I found everything you asked for. How soon can you finish this unbreakable cord? As soon as it wants to be made. You cannot rush this kind of magic. It flows with a speed all its own. Find me as soon as it's ready. By the way, after we spoke of the Hoogr, a cousin came by with his own spirit tale. I don't trust coincidence, so this one's free. What did he say? He told me his sister's husband, Borin, drank a mead brewed in Jotunheim, and it sent his hooger into a goat. The spirit of a dwarf in the body of a goat? <laughs> Stranger still, his sister didn't even notice. Happy! Don't drag me into this. The tower is nearly finished. Do not fret. The final hours are ticking down. Not fast enough. I feel the jaws of a trap closing upon me. Knowing you are in a trap is the first step to avoiding it. You don't care if I'm married off to this builder, do you? You are the Queen of Asgard, the host of Folkvanger, the Shepherd of the Slain. Of course I care. Yet you act as if I'm some treasure to be traded about. I was wrong to use you like that. I will confront the Builder and pry the truth out of him. A limp apology. But it will suffice for now. Once the Builder is dealt with, turn your spear on Loki. Every chance he had, he dug us deeper into this mess. If Loki is up to something, I will see to it that he is punished. Blood Oath be damned. <laughs> Yes. The fog cleared suddenly. I, I can speak of what I've seen, but I felt pulled away. Say nothing of it now. Return to this another time. I will, when I'm ready. I want to see the Alliance map.
What of Oxenifordshire? Sigurd told me he had business there. Ah, yes. Sigurd is there now, in fact. He bids you go meet him as soon as you can. He has partnered with a rebellious thane called Giedrich, and hopes to install Giedrich as Elderman in exchange for an oath. There is an alehouse at the center of Buckingham. Sigurd will meet you there. I should join my brother then. Where is Buckingham? <laughs> Along the Great Owls River that divides Oxenifordshire, Sigurd will be pleased to see you. Let's go. Sail! Catch the wind! Sing us a song. Who will share a tale? Here's a tale we all remember when Eivor gave orders to attack Kjot. There was a woman called Nal who came by ship to Fornberg and had... Did I ever tell you all the story of how I... Hush now. Stories must wait. I'll bet the priest keeps silver there. Were you at the good part yet? Did I ever tell you all the story of who not of the ugly was an excellent sailor who could pile a long ship entirely ravens. on it? Take the mask down. Mask up. Let the sail out.
shouldn't be seen here. A hood should work. Soldiers on alert. What has happened here? Run up the sail! Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Aid me, be my eyes. Wound. An alehouse. This must be it. Sigurd is not here. I'll ask around. I'm looking for two men. Not locals. A Norse and an Arab. The fellas the soldiers came after. If I were you, friend, I'd keep mum about them. It's on the day. Christus for you and his. Achtaf, Wolf Heldung, Skolon for Rodjan, and Hellau, and Eichnesen. This way now, you say. These soldiers always leave a bleeding mess. Are you the alewife here? You are not welcome here. I've had enough trouble with Danes today. I'm not here to cause trouble. I'm looking for my brother, a large Norseman. It was him what caused the ruckus. Him and that other one were here. Talking to Thane Giedrich. Then Lady Edwin's soldiers swept in. A fight broke out. Your brother and the tanned fella got away. The soldiers nabbed Giedrich, though. I was sorry to see that. He's well liked in these parts. Which way did my brother go? Hmm. What's it worth to you to find out? I am asking a simple question. Look, Dane. You start a scene or a scuffle, and I'll scream for soldiers. You're risking your life, and I'm the one who'll take it. Oh, my. All I know is they jumped through the window. Guards! Help! Help! What? Help! Help! With you. Help! Keep the run! <laughs> 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 
Sigurd and Basim headed south. They wouldn't go far. I'll check along the river. Show me. See you, old friend. It smells like a fish house. Good spot to hide. Wait! Stop! Alan was Sahalan Eivor. We could have caught you to bloody giblets, Wolfkist. Why so unnerved, brother? It's not like you. Half the soldiers of the Shire are hunting us. You must have noticed. Is that why you haven't come home? You're playing hide and fetch with the Mercian soldiers. Your brother's a busy man, Eivor. Weighed down by pressing duties. I wasn't speaking to you, Basim. I'll hear Sigurd's answers from Sigurd. Brother, we should be forging alliances. Send this man back to his warren before he leads you astray. Eivor, gods above, I'm grateful you've joined us. We have made strides towards an alliance, in fact. A local thane called Gidritz has pledged an oath to me. I've heard of him. The alewife also mentioned a Lady Edwin who commands the soldiers. Why not ally with her? Lady Edwin's husband was the Shire's elderman, until Gudrun's army ended his life. Now she's taking up her husband's fight. ...with a promise of aid from King Alfred of Wessex. Edwin vows revenge on the Danes who stole her husband and her livelihood. From what we know, Alfred is a fearsome king. If Edwin can win his full support, this shire is lost to Wessex. So to fight her, you've pledged your sword to a minor thane who likely commands a gang of farmers and fishermen. Have faith, Eivor. A few hundred Saxons armed with hayforks and billhooks can be terrified. Gods! All men and women, noble or peasant, have within them the seeds of something greater. This is true. Sometimes greater than the average mind can fathom. Well, Edwin has Giedrich in shackles now. All your plotting has turned to ash. Not if we act soon. She dragged her prisoners to the Longhouse. With you here, we can mount the surprise strike. If Giedrich is our best chance for an alliance, let's see it done. Sigurd, has Basim talked you into something of little reward? Eivor, have you lost hope in your Warcraft? I heed back. Sim is secretive by nature, but he is wise and forthright, and he has... So unusual, so incredible, it will shatter your mind to shards. Brother, our bond has the iron heft of a war axe. Do not let Basim and his prophecies of good fortune. Yeah. Work with me. Not much longer. To go.
Do not let Basim and his prophecies of good fortune sway you from our simple goal. Never. Our goal is fixed. We shall soon be the lords of Mercia, then all of England. But Basim has a deep insight. He's read wisdom in the lines of my face and heard the little. Have a look, Sunin. Be time enough for my saga later. Sigurd, kill this sweaty fishwife. Stay your blades. This traitor Giedrich will face trial, as will all the treasonous thanes of this shire. You're the traitor, Edwin, calling on Alfred of Wessex, begging for his army. Clap your mead hole, Giedrich, lapdog of the Danes. You'll sell us out to Wessex, and that poxy ass bastard Alfred. We won't have it. Lady, there's no need for slaughter. We all want peace for Xenophotshire. Can we find some agreement? You heathenish fork-tongued Dane. Foul-smelling heap, I shit on you all. Lady, choose your next words with care. For you see before you the future master of all England, Sigurd of the Hungry Raven Clan. Lay down your arms. 
Free my friend here, and kiss my lordly feet. You will not get a second chance. Sigurd, are you cracked? And you can kiss my rosy red ass, Wayface. I've done with this offal. I leave them to you. Flay them alive and tan their flesh for saddles. Take your last oh, breath. Oh, 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 what have they done to you? What kind of mess did you get yourself into? I can still fight these bastards. <laughs> escaped I was desperate to fight you should have freed me Giedrich this is Aver, my stone armed sibling well met that was your plan Sigurd to charm the lady with your vague hope of kingship prophecy Aver, not hope no time to squabble Edwin's taken most of the Shire's thanes she has her way they'll be dead by supper tend your wounds Giedrich We'll free your friends. And what of the holy woman, Fulke? You promised us a meeting with her. I did, aye. But it's a fair mystery why you'd want to talk Where is with... she? Thane Holt will know. Fulke lives on his lands. But he'll be dead with the rest if you don't stop the trial. Tell us where, and we'll go now. Their lives depend on the speed of your tongue. Southwest of here, halfway to Oxenaforda, at the Leech Vila garrison. Basim! Eivor! To horse! We should on lava no fundians. Again, Aver, you and I, with blades drawn and hearts ablaze. Who is this Fulke that Basim spoke of? An ally, Aver. A most important ally. A holy woman who trades in prophecies and secret knowledge. That is not the sort of alliance we're looking for, Sigurd. No, it's even better. You cannot imagine what discoveries await. You're speaking strangely, brother. 